Oh no, OBS is working. We're good. Swing. Oh. Yeah. Live? We're live, I think. All right. Welcome, everyone, to the Becoming the Senate roleplay. Um, for those of you that may be unawares, I am currently playing through Stellaris Nemesis uh, with the goal of becoming Steve Palpatine in the Senate. I am the Senate. Uh, that's my goal, anyways. And so, as I play... I am going through and making decisions based upon what, you know, I believe she would have done in that moment. Uh, as the end goal is, is to become the Senate. Rule the galaxy. Consolidates my new empire. Kind of thing, right? Um, to catch you up, last time, uh, we... Uh, the birth of space piracy just happened. And we sent our fleet to deal with the pirates within our empire. Um, and, uh, yeah, we crushed them. Uh, because we have a decent first fleet happening right here. Uh, we got, you know, we got some damage going on there. Only a couple, couple damage. But, yeah, these guys, they held up pretty good, actually. I don't think I lost a single one, no. Still full. So that's, that's where we're at. Uh, as of right now. Oh, look, this is the first time I've gotten a good look at the research station. It's pretty cool, I'm not going to lie. Hello, Piercer, what's up? So, uh, that's, that's yeah, that's where we're at. We are continuing our march towards uh, empirical dominance. Uh, we are slowly expanding the Empire in kind of this, like, weird amoeba formation. Um, we've met one one group thus far and it's these guys and they're they're okay um yeah i'm gonna actually start to improve relations with them because they, they seem okay they're they're a machine intelligence and i don't want to fuck with them right now so sheev would sheev in, in his infinite wisdom would uh, he would make friends with the machines so that maybe later he can use them uh so we're gonna send uh yeah, we'll send Edmund. And Edmund Marsh, go make friends with the Zero One Architects. Assure them that we are no threat to them. And in turn, begin building your spy network. Might as well, right? Um, yeah, so I guess send an envoy who will work on a building within their empire. Oh no, we already have the envoy. No, we'll just build relations right now. <laughs> trying to catch up on a show. That's great, Piercer. So we're going to do that. Um, do we have a non-aggression pack maybe with them? That would be good for right now. I think... Uh, there they cannot... Okay, so they're just all consciousness. Uh, I think we can form a research agreement, right? Let's see. This will increase their trust of us. We have much to learn from one another. Let's see. Former research agreement is both empires gain a bonus when researching technologies discovered by the other empire. Yeah. Um. This will increase their trust of us by plus 10 each month up to a maximum of 50. It will cost us 0.25 influence every month. I can't really spare that. All right, so there's that. Um. Why won't they... Oh, it's negative 8. I gotta wait. I'll be able to do that later, just not quite yet. So, but they're cordial with me. They're not really a threat right now, so I'm not gonna deal with them. We just, I just know they're there. But I'm gonna try to expand as much as I can. Maybe, maybe get hereish. Grab this black hole. Maybe grab this little star here. Yeah, I'm trying to see. That's I got, definitely got to do that. Unsurveyed, unsurveyed. And a. Uh, backyard here this is i got alien vessels that are like super super tough here lurk thank you and lushito hello as previously encountered yeah we're not messing with them they're they were they were tough they have like forty three thousand or something <laughs> there's no way i can beat them right now um okay you yeah 
Yes, you're going to do that. Catch up on what everybody's doing. You have no orders presently. Um, is that surveyed? Yeah, that's surveyed. Uh, is that surveyed? That is not. Alright, so how about you do this? What your construction ship? Um, what do we... Oh, we have plenty of Empire Sprawl left. Left to give. Um, and to do this... 67 and 90... Yeah, why not, right? Maybe potentially out. Well, it's not really going to give us anything. It's only three research, though. Uh, unsurveyed. You got nothing going on there. Need monies. Need monies bad. That's because what happened with Luke's helmet? Oh, I forgot to turn it on. Uh, on back after uh, for the uh, the the big brain stream. Hold on, give me one second. I can turn that back on. But you know what? No, actually, I'm not going to turn it on. Because technically, I'm role-playing Chief Palpatine, and at no point would he wear a rebel helmet. <laughs> I'll turn it on when I'm not when I'm not doing this. Uh, maybe tomorrow when I play another game. Um, but for right now, I have to decide what's my next move. Construction ships aren't doing it. You're doing that. You're moving. No, you're, you have no orders. Okay. So then what your orders are going to be is to survey this system and survey that system because at least we can go out to here kind of grab these choke points that's an unclaimed system yeah you know go grab it and uh i think this is this is actually pretty this is pretty decent right here so maybe you go build one here right why not I'm going to have to go have them do, like, survey other Antarctic world. Can't live there. But yes, I have three planets now, by the way. The independent, I have the Hyrule. I have Alpha Centauri, which, and uh, Alderaan, surrounding Alpha Centauri. So, uh, they're doing all right. Alderaan's still colonizing. That's why I'm, I'm low on, no, I'm low on money because I have this. No, maybe that's. My low on monies. Ooh, we need jobs here. Gerbs. But what we need is cities. Um, so this is an industrial world. Right? Um, yeah, we need cities. That would pro provide clerk jobs, which we only need one. And house. Yeah, we need to build a city. Oh, wait. We're already building one. What the hell? How about we do this? And then we close that, yeah. Or industrial district. Oh no, I guess. Yeah, that's fine. That's good. We'll leave that go. Why am I why am I so strapped for cash right now? What the hell is he what the hell is burning a hole in my pocket? The ships? Nah. Ships, star bases, districts, leaders. Here's the ships. I gotta go send the ships back to a starbase. I gotta go repair anyways. Go back to Seoul. We're going. Okay, so yeah, we'll uh, we'll speed this up a little bit. They're coming back. They're going. We're building. You're building, right? Yeah. You're going that way. Good. We have to. We still have to like you know meet some people. You know. I feel like science ship. This one, so you're doing that and that, and then I want you to. That's unsurveyed. Survey that. That's a black hole, which is nice. Construction complete. Interesting. We've made first contact with mysterious aliens in the Obskike system. For now, we have codenamed them Twinkies. <laughs> <laughs> Until we can find out more about them. If they possess a language, we must decipher it in order to establish communications. Okay. Um, first fleet has been fully repaired. That's great. Where is this? Where, where did we... Where did we meet these people? Can we go, please? Oh. 
So they're oh they're hereish somehow. Hey, can I no? I want this. I want this. Nope, that's not where I wanted to go either. What the hell's wrong with you? <laughs> we want to go here. We want to see what their ships look like. Where are they? Oh, they're right here. Oh, that's uh, huh. eleven point one thousand. Fuck me. Well, shit. That's a fortress. That's not a station. That's a fucking fortress. Well, I know exactly what they are. I think. Um, but conquer or join. Um, these these guys. Uh, no, we're gonna send an envoy though. Uh, please don't die, Yuzi. Please don't die. I'd prefer that. You do that. Good. Construction complete. Repairs completed. Good. Yeah, look at that. Jesus Christ. Creepy. Hmm. It's troubling. It's just this random station here. Yeah, there definitely there's some sort of empire here that we're gonna have to be concerned with that's like right button up right up against us. Maybe, maybe, if we improve relations with them well enough, uh we can you know. Alright, well then you know what we're gonna do? We're not gonna worry about that. We're actually gonna go this way. After you're done here. Right? Yeah. Wait until that's wow, that's fuck, man. <laughs> it is I have sense of disturbance in the force. Troy, that's a lot of my face. Star system charted. Star system charted. All right. Doing that, doing that, good. Get this going. Oh, I can build a building here, I guess. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, so. Ooh, nice. Another one. Right. This is the one we're going to go to. We'll come back to this. We have managed to pick up a clear audio feed of conversations between several Twinkie ships. <laughs> Awful name. <laughs> it's only half past up, but I don't care. Uh, while our linguists are still none the wiser as to the meanings of any of their words they are recording, they are optimistic that this new signal will help them make significant progress towards a breakthrough. Excellent. Keep working. Um, too angled. The service of Hishmael uh, is utterly without... Oh, got more, uh, more things with the aliens. What we got? We've picked up readings of an unknown nature. The signals seem to follow some kind of repeating syntax, which could indicate sapient origin. It should be investigated further. They seem to be concentrated around a single space station, though it is unclear whether this forms part of a larger spacefaring civilization. Proceed. With your investigation of the Twinkies. <laughs> Bunch of fucking twinks. <laughs> Construction. There we go. Um, just consolidating here. You also build that research station. Or, er, uh, yeah, research. Look at that black hole. Star system charted. Star system charted. All right, now I want you to go to this one first. I'm going to survey that system. Why? Because it's a pulsar. I have a feeling that having a pulsar may be good for us in the long run. It looks like there's some maybe. That looks like a barren world, maybe. Construction complete. That's a barren world, definitely. Toxic world. Well, the, ooh, we have an election happening. And don't don't forget, we also have the Shadow Council on our sides, which means for t a measly 12, we can support whoever the hell we want. Um, let's see. Dolores Mwanga, we can have her come back. It means our outpost build cost and building cost and district cost and planetary build speed. Uh, so... Wow, she does... She does not enjoy a lot of support. Presently, the full enfranchisement party receives the majority of support. 
Then Starbase module cost and happiness is plus five. You know what? We will let Charlotte Leclerc win again, win a second term. Have we completed her aggressive agriculture? We have, which means we're going to get a bunch of research right at the end. So just to ensure she wins. There we go. <laughs> we have decided that Charlotte Leclerc has proven herself useful to the Empire. And so she will, she will remain. She shall remain as our, uh, what do I have? Uh, I can't even remember. District Mandrate fulfilled as per our Grand, grand Chancellor. That's right. The Grand Chancellor's mandate. Our planetary districts have expanded. Uh, that they have. And I believe she's going to win again. Yep. She won again. Nice. Re-elected. Look at her. She looks angry. It's fine. Uh, so you, since you've done that, how about you go and build here? You get more of that. Oh, good. Monies. Money. We get monies again. Because, uh... I don't know why, all of a sudden... Really, it was the ships. They leave... Ooh, ooh. Oh, look at this. We're starting to see further. All right, hold on. Have been successfully translating their language, we have established communications with the independent space station of the Zura Corp. Let's see if they want to talk. Foreign power is hailing us. Oh, it's a high trader. Welcome to Zura Corp. He's a bird person. Uh, we are a business conglomerate operating out of the Alpskike system, specializing in trade, the very building blocks of civilization, as we like to say here at Zuracorp. Please do not hesitate to contact us if you're interested in making a good deal. Oh, so they're like friendly traders. Word. That's awesome. Cool. So they're there. Um, and if I do this... Ooh, 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 just quality resources ready to be pumped right into this. What are, we, what are your... Oh. You can, like, buy shit from them. Interesting. Cool. Um, speak your expertise. Requires this trader on, uh, to have opinion of us plus 50. Nothing for now. How do we improve the opinion? I'm assuming buy shit from them. For 120 months... In the following it effects. Huh. Uh, I don't need exotic gases yet, but good to know that's like a quick way to get them if I do need them. It's kind of awesome, actually. All right, so you're going to go investigate the pulsar because I would like the pulsar to be in my system. It would be very nice. Nice, nice, nice. You're digging, right? You are digging, excavating, yes. Uh, what are you doing? Whole lot, oh yes, you're building that. Um, and then, well, we'll wait. You are waiting until one of these things has been, uh, don't need to think about that, Jerry Troy. Um, Oh, there's... No, that's just trade. So, what I should do... I already have the three. Two, three, four. Oh, I can have seven. So I can have... Yeah, my trade's alright for right now. See, what's my trade? 36, yeah. We're good. We're golden. Continue forth. Continue forth. Expand the empire. Then, uh... Sphere of influence well, expanded. What's expanded? Newly founded colony. Established the colony. Oh, okay. They finally are finished building. You know, it's an entire system. Word. Look at this. Lovely. Okay, they're a colony, right? Well, let us. Is there anything that we need? No, for right now. How about. Right now, they're a colony. 
But for Alderaan, we make them a densely populated where the one glowing metropolis leads the most directly into the next. How to make an uh, we're gonna do No, we don't need agriculture. I feel like we need a forge world. That's what we need. I'm gonna turn it into a forge world. And as a result, the first thing we're gonna build is fucking alloy foundries. Um Yeah. Good. But what did I just dismiss? Did I dismiss the uh, first contact thing? No, we already made contact. That was the thing. <laughs> uh, let's see. I uh, wish I could say we got some work to do. going to finish the episodes of the show. Oh, good night, Piercer. Mmm. Let's see. No, that's... Jesus Christ. It appears that the passageway descending towards the underground chamber has suffered some mishap in the past. A cave-in has filled the lower part of the shaft with boulders and dust, in turn making the excavation benches slow and frustrating. Keep digging. Alright, I'm going to keep digging. In the meantime, uh, you're doing that, you're doing that. Do I have... I do. Word, word, word. Okay, so how about you... Survey all of these systems, please. That would be nice. Let's see what we have back there. No, no, thank you, Piercer. I appreciate that. All right, we're waiting. Still waiting. Still waiting. Technology secured. Ooh, let's see what we can pop road speed. Nice. Uh, so can we do farming subsidies? We don't really need food right yet. I'm sure we will if our pop keeps growing. Yeah, you know what? It's this gene clinics. Advanced medical treatments, which is good, but I think we're going to do, yeah. Should I be able to? Well, let's see. Uh, yeah. Features. Yeah, see, in order to get rid of the jungles, maybe that's what I want. I believe they have... Yeah, there's jungles here. Maybe we should do that so that we can get rid of those jungles. Naboo is all clear. We're good. We're good there. Yeah, that's going to be the research. It's not the fanciest of research, but... To clear those uh, tiles so that we can get more farming. Can't wait till I get these fucking... Yeah. Strike craft. Gonna throw them on my ships. Actually, I don't think I have any ships that can carry strike craft yet. But at least my bases. An anomaly is found. Ooh. Okay. Good. Good. What's this? The study of pulsar seems to be an endless source of insights for our scientists, but rarely exhibit any signs of overtly dangerous phenomena. This makes the recent reports on Usuldan all the more concerning. An initial scan revealed that the pulsar, in addition to its regular electromagnetic beam, is emitting a separate beam at a limited wavelength which is only visible in the same system at shorter and shorter intervals. According to initial calculations, the interval between these pulses will reach zero at 2300-0101. What occurs then is open to speculation, but the lack of explanation for the pulse has instilled an almost superstitious fear in those who studied it. We will have answers. We will have answers eventually. We must be watchful. Keep an eye on the Well, that's good. Maybe I should uh, research the... Uh... Cool, cool. So this will be faster. Improved reactor booster. Definitely make our ships faster. Well, more powerful anyways. Keep doing that. You're good. You're surfing. I got my three worlds in a line here. Uh, buildings can be built. I think what we shall do. Anomaly found. Another one. Construction complete. Ship debris. Word. You build research stations, and then build mining stations. Uh, back to. 
soul, Naboo. That's what I wanted. Um, planet deficit. I'm down on two. How about? And yeah, because it's the capital, so. How about we build more administrative offices? No, we already have administrative. Oh well, yeah, maybe we do need need more administrative capacity. That's uh yeah from pops, which is gonna keep growing. Yeah, maybe that's what we need. Mm-hmm. 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 They don't really need anything else. Okay, stronghold. Soldiers increase naval capacity and spawn defense armies. We can also do that, too. I mean, it's our capital world. We should probably have... Hey, Yuri! What's up, buddy? Yeah, you want... I feel like you want your uh, planetary stronghold causing a substantial garrison force to protect the world from invasion and rebellion. What's the count? I don't really... Mm, mm. My armies. Yeah, I have first and second planetary guard. Do I even have armies on Hyrule? I do, actually. How about that? But... Stronghold... And it creates two soldier jobs, which increase naval capacity, which would be nice as well. And it creates plus six. Yes, you know what? We need one of those. We're going to do that. I rule. What you got here? What can we do here? You are definitely going to be an industrial world. We're going to create consumer goods here on Hyrule. Um... same time, there's a lot of blocks here that need to be urged. we be able to clear those dense jungles in a beat. And so, first... Yeah, you need amenities. That's what we need. So, as a result, because you want amenities... Uh, maybe what we will do... Because mm, there's a way to produce amenities as well. Oh, yeah, by doing clerks. There's nine pops. Three housing. I'd like more amenities. Go to Tyrol. Let the people... And they turn consumer goods into unity and amenities. And unity is always good. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. That's just amenities. Uh, at least let's, let's produce unity as well. Right? Yeah. Amenities, yeah. This is... We're gonna do that one. Hyrule shall have a hollow theater. And then Alderaan is a forge world, <laughs> uh, producing our alloys. Which means we're going to need to produce another one of these at some point. They don't have the pops yet. There's not, not even anybody sitting in those jobs. So, we'll get there. We'll get there. Let's do that. Good. Star system charted. Star system charted. Oh, you never built a research station. Well, then you're going to build a star base. And then you're going to build... Well, after you build that. How about... Wow, there's a lot there. You for now. Let's... Survey. Survey. Ooh. An ancient orbital shipyard. It's down here. Nice. Recent battle damage and higher sections of the facility are missing. Interesting. There's some great, great things that, that you know, 
people are going to have to go research in a, in a hot second. You, oh, you have to build, uh, are, are you building mining stations presently? You are. Hey, you know what? That's, that's the choke. We're going to hold that, even though, look at the monies. Not going to do that. We're not going to do that. I guess if I go grab that choke. You know what? You don't go that way yet. Not quite yet. We're going to do... I even want to expand that far yet. Hmm. Ooh, what's this? Research agreement proposal. That would be lovely. You're going to give me so much research. Agree. See, we're becoming friends with the robots. With the robots. Star system charted. All right, star system charted, archaeological site discovered again. So many of them. Um, can we, let's do this. Because we're a little, you know, active sensor link maybe. But communications. But just the communications. No, they don't want to give communications. Great. How about... What if we trade communications and we have plenty of monies? What if I give you some energy credits? Oh, jeez. Yeah, that's not gonna that's not gonna work at all. all right, so we're not there yet, I guess. If I gave you a favor. Ooh. Then we can also get an active sensor link. And I'll give them one favor. Grants you a, a favor to be used in the future. What if you gave me a favor? Nope. Wow. Alright, you know, I'll give them the favor. Screw it. Alright. I get active sensor link. What's this do? I don't need to give him that. I don't. I can give him a favor in communications. But he doesn't, he still won't be able to know what's going on in my, uh, yes, she would do that. Yes, of course, you can, but don't, don't, don't look in what's going on. So yeah, yes, of course, we shall bestow upon them a favor. If I deem fit. <laughs> Confirm that. Being processed. All right, let's see. We'll see if that works. In the meantime, can we do... Oh, ask to be there, Vassal. Um, defensive pack, non-aggression pack. Not yet, right? Ooh, we're getting closer there, though. I can't even increase the number of favors. Huh? All right. We'll probably be able to do it to a, a, a non-aggression pack soon with them. Ooh. See, so now we've met another group because of them. This is now we've seen, we've, we see where they are. Interesting. We are receiving a transmission from the Yasurandavana Raveners. They appear to have successfully translated our language. Diplomatic channels are now open and all hostilities between us have ceased for the moment. They're a devouring swarm, and they're right next to us. We sense the presence of prey. Prey, know that we are your hunters. The biomass of the human species will fuel the growth of the... Boy. Oh, boy. The growth of the Yisranar Raveners. Struggle if you must. It will not change the outcome. Hmm... We are going to seek to distance ourselves from them, and they are not going to be able to grow a spy network on us. So let's do that. Uh, let's just do that. <laughs> the news that we have encountered intelligent alien life for the first time. We met like these magic space robots. What are you talking about? First time intelligence. 
uh, is spreading like a wildfire throughout the United Imperium of Naboo. Our citizens are fascinated by these beings, and the media is full of reports and speculation on their culture and society. The revelation that we are not alone in this galaxy has largely been greeted with celebration on Naboo. Just like us, the aliens appear to be relative newcomers on the galactic stage, and their level of technology is similar to our own. Ow, holy shit. They have so many planets. Fuck me, man. So what is that? I want to see what is what is that ship? A proactive caretaker squad. Transport module. Oh, so these are like rope. Those are robot soldiers. The robots. Robot soldiers. They're going somewhere. Right? Let's see what they're. Uh... Ooh, they have um colony ship they're colonizing like fucking crazy look at that there you go nice nice yo 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 sagawa station jesus i never want to mess with these people these fucking robots all right um Where's the Raveners? Yeah, we need to we need to set up a spy network with them because they're very suspicious suspicious of us. So we need to know what the hell's going on. Um let's send the 73-year-old. No, how about we send the 60-year-old? Can I can I recruit <laughs> uh, some more fucking envoys? How do I get envoys? How do I how do I increase my number of envoys? Because I would like to do that. Um like shit because <laughs> my boys are like 70 years old hmm. why why are you uh why are you um uh, uh posting lyrics to sweet caroline in my chat there troy uh <laughs> a little weird we younger soon we will feed we need to know what's going on here so send the send the old woman we're gonna send the old woman Build that spy network. Challenging. Yeah, of course it's going to be challenging. We've established a spy network. We have received our first clandestine report from spy master UZ inside the Yisrael of Ravners. This marks the establishment of our first spy network within Xeno territory. Whenever they make a move, we stand a better chance of it playing right into our hands. Alright, we're not going to engage in diplomacy with them, but we are going to, you know. Receiving communications. Great deal offer. Oh, they accepted it. Cool. What about this? Form an aggression pack. That's what I like to see. Please, please, please. Um, and then the Chiban. The Segan Protectors. Stagnant Ascendancy. We Guardians. Oh, okay. So these guys, they don't, they don't do anything. We're just going to let them go. These guys are all right. As long as we don't mess with them because they're super fucking strong. These guys are close, though. All right, then what we have to do. We're not going to expand any more closer to them than we need to. Maybe we should. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If I maybe maybe we're going to do this. We're going to send you. Because that's already been... Yeah. We're going to send you to survey the, the shit fast. Um, Construction um, complete. Naboo. We are totally going to build because I need more empire. I need yeah, more administrative capacity. So I know this is... We're, we're down and that doesn't fucking matter. <laughs> We need more administrative offices, so we're going to do that. Because we need to be able to build more star bases quickly. And in fact, we're going to send you guys here. We're going to upgrade this base. 
piece of Kila. While cleaning, clearing away rubble and rocks, a peculiar discovery was made. An alien tool that most closely resembles a common pickaxe was found crushed between craggy rocks. Uh, I'd be doing some 3D modeling and sculpting tonight. That's awesome, Yuri. Are you streaming it or just kind of kind of fiddling around? Crushed between craggy rocks. If the mining technology retained by previous diggers was on par with that type of equipment, the previous digging of that shaft, a shaft hundreds of meters deep, shows a remarkable commitment. What... What is it in the depth that is worthy of such excursion? Keep digging. That's how I imagine Palpatine is just like, keep digging. So yeah, you're upgrading. Good. And then research. Us. So guess what that is getting? And fusion missiles. Oh boy. Yes. Yeah. Just chill and get my chaps back with some tutorials. Nice. It's coming along well. Been a while since I've enjoyed doing any art. I wish I was more artistic than I am. Uh, I was a, a was a musician for a bit. Um, never really that good at it. <laughs> but, you know. All right. Keep going. Keep going. You're digging... You're exploring. I have you coming back this way. Cause fuck that noise up there. If we got these these guys encroaching upon our territory, how's the your espionage happening? Ooh, almost, almost. Uh, and then we can start to gather information. Anomaly found. You just gained level. Great. 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 Anomaly found. Great. Great. Oh boy, difficulty. Hell. Jesus. Uh, difficulty will reduce the likelihood of getting successful results at the end of an operation. Difficulty can be reduced by assigning an asset with modifier corresponding to the type of operation. Okay. Each stage of an espionage operation can have a different difficulty value. This is the... It's still hell plus. Jesus. Uh... Technical artist, yeah, okay, can create, recreate, not so much create. I think I'm, I'm, I'm with you in that one. I can definitely recreate. That's a, that's a good way to put it. Jesus, look at their, their opinion of us is awful. At least these guys are nice. I don't know anything about them though. Challenging. Maximum infiltration level. Negative 20. The connecting announcement, we experience these effects. Their code breaking is routine relative to our encryption. Oh boy, when conducting as they experience these effects, zero penalty. But we have a hard penalty. Well, you know what? We're going to try it. We have to. Upkeep, for, so 400 costs for That's fine. Also, commencement ready. Just after you've, uh... Is there a game through the acquire asset operation or through... Oh, okay. We're just gonna try that for now. i try and find out more about them. That's as possible. Star system charted. Star system charted. No, you know what? I just want you to go this way. Just... Survey that system, and then survey that system. So you've done that already. Whatever. Cool. Great. Um, but you... Alright, so that's upgrading. Construction complete. There it is. Yeah, keep going. Um... I think what we will do... Yeah, we're going to do crew quarters. Because we're going to station our fleet there. Is I think what we're going to do. And then we're also going to have the hangar bay. And... Mm, what's a nuclear? Nuclear. 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 Adds two missile weapon slots to the star rates, which is great. Yeah, we're going to do that. 
This is just going to be a heavily defended thing, and then we're also going to build a defense platform as well. And I wish I knew what their ships were, but we're just going to do a basic defense platform. Yeah, mostly lasers to get through their fucking... No, it should be mostly guns, honestly. Um, yeah, 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 that works. Do that. That way it's kind of fair, you know? I think maybe mostly guns would... Let's do mostly guns. That way if they do have shields, we just tear through them. Yeah. That's what we said do. That's what we said do. And do that. Save that. Um, that's good. That's good. Yeah. 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 See? Yeah. That's not what I wanted. But that. I'm gonna do defenses. I'm gonna build that. Because it has missiles. It has... That's going to be a top cookie somewhat. So start building. Oh boy. A group of auxiliary op operatives has begun shying away from their assigned tasks. Oh boy. Citing a lack of confidence in their overall purpose. Spy Master UZ would typically handle such matters without bringing them to our attention. But even without them knowing any details, these operatives seem unusually well informed about Operation Gather Information and perhaps the spy network as a whole. Given that these auxiliaries are kept isolated from our more active and better informed agents, Yuzi suspects the operatives are being fed information from an outside source. She also concedes that they may simply be highly perceptive individuals. Given these doubts and the threats posed to Operation Gather by each scenario, Spy Master Yuzi requests a directive on how to proceed. Jesus. Okay, so. Hmm, a group of auxiliary operatives has begun shying away from their assigned tasks, fighting a lack of confidence in their overall purpose. The operatives seem unusually well informed about gather information, and perhaps the spy network as a whole. Hmm. Lost auxiliary operatives modifier added for 12 months, giving the operation difficulty plus 2 or 8. Or, 16% of the chance unwavering insight happens in 5 days, 83% chance of the event panicked operatives. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy that's a fucking gamble um so for a year we get the lost auxiliary operatives modifier which makes everything we do more difficult by two or we take a gamble uh, i mean yolo you only live once right We've made first contact with the... Yeah, so it's, again, it's going to happen in five days. So we'll see what happens. Um, she, even that instance, would be kind of the wait and see type. It would be like, let us see what developments come of it. So that's why we're doing it. We've made first contact with the mysterious aliens in the Ogakapa system. For now, we have codenamed the Tengus. The Tengus. Until we can find out more about them. So I'm assuming they're bird people? Okay. Cool, interesting. And uh, have applied themselves with unusual. Oh, how about this? Unwavering insight. We we, we won, see? Sheev. The insight of Sheev always works. Our auxiliary operatives in the Ravenous, I'm just going to call them the Ravenous, in the Ravenous system have applied themselves with unusual fervor upon learning that their once intangible suspicions were founded in a real cause after all. Spy Master UZ maintains a strict information quarantine, but reports that her supply lines have never been smoother. Excellent. Um, operation difficulty is now minus one for the next three years. So, Sheev's 
Nice. Um, nice. All right, so we have the ship build cost and speed is down. Ship upkeep down. Ooh, yes. We're going to need ship fire rate increase. I have a feeling that'll be next. No, that'll be next. <laughs> we need we need to, to boost. We need to boost. 89 months. Fuck. <laughs> Relics. Can we do anything with this? Discover precursor inside. Learn the location of a precursor site. Oh, I don't need that yet. All right. All right, all right, all right. Construction complete. Good. System surveyed. Good. Earth contact. Our only available envoy. Go meet with them. Ooh, they're dragon people. Ooh, alloys. Only one, but still. We are receiving a transmission from the independent space station of the Artisan Troop. Artisan Troop. They appear to have successfully translated our language. Great. Look at these guys. A visitor is a joyous occasion indeed. I'm assuming... Yeah, we don't need this anymore. No? Yeah? Whatever. It's a joyous occasion indeed. Oh, forgive my manners. I believe introductions are in order. We are the Artisan Troop. Our members have dedicated their lives to the pursuit of art, music, culture, and all other things which makes existence bearable to our sapient being. Please, if you would like to share in the wonder of our creations, do not hesitate to contact us. Where are they? Um... Where's the artisan troop? Receiving did... communications. Ooh, defensive pact with the machines, please. Because you guys are a hell of a lot stronger than I am, I think. Why not? Right? Yeah, they have a bigger fleet than us. We only have this one little fleet, which I can add to presently. Um, but I don't think... Yeah, uh, a Corvette. My defensive platform. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Can I... Ooh, I can do a hangar section for that defense platform. Maybe I'll do that. Yes, maybe I will do that. Because, well, we're paused, right? Yeah. What is this hangar bay? Does what? It just adds a hangar. But if we add two, because hangers are good. Hangar, hangar bays are pretty good. So we're actually going to do, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Ship designer, we're going to switch this so that um, on this side here, we're actually going to have a hangar section. Right here, we're going to have basic strike craft. The basic strike craft, what do they do? Look at this. 4 to 10. Right? Accuracy 100. Average damage 24. Point 34. But there's 8 units. And each of them do 4 to 10 versus 7 to 21, one unit. Right? That's technically a maximum of 80 damage per unit. Um, yeah. We're going to do that. And then this can have this thing. Uh... Same. Yes. Here we go. Doing that. These guys we have made, so for now we have the tangos. That's still going. Cool. Don't need it. Continue. So that's still building. Ooh. Need housing, which means a city district is coming your way. Actually, no, this creates housing, and because this is a forge world, and we need alloys, because that's what we're going to do for now. Uh, seems to be approaching the limits of his abilities. 
fine. That's fine. Uh, so I got these guys who I can maybe call in. Look at all this. They're discovering. Look at Arctic, Arctic, Arctic. Arid. Continental. There's a good continental world. It's right on the edge, though. Ooh, an even better one. Yeah, you're going to go and discover. So you're discovering that. And then also... Ooh. Nice. Finally, reaching the bottom of the dig, the cause of the anomaly reading was unveiled. An old tomb, likely to be the burial ground for some alien ruler. There wasn't enough time to investigate further. Moments after entering the mausoleum, some ancient but powerful trap activated. It triggered a local earthquake, making the shaft quickly lose structural integrity and start to collapse. Narrowly, fatal damage to, to the expedition was avoided, but the shaft is once more full of loose rocks and boulders. Let dead kings lie. Uh, research option gain. Tomb World Adaptation. Hmm. Interesting. Alright, so you're... You're done up there. How about... Do that. You're, you're gonna start researching anomalies for us. You're just gonna start cruising through these systems. And researching these anomalies. Um... Cruising through. Cruising through. Please. <laughs> Do it. Do it. First contact event pending. The public has been informed of a potential first contact scenario in the Ogikapus system where the presence of an unidentified spacecraft was registered. Ogikapus system. Which is that? Where's the Ogapu system? Oh, it's way the fuck up there. Interesting. There's the Tengus, first of all. And then the, this new one. Okay, so they're like squid people. Interesting. Keep at it. It suggests this was capable of hyperspace travel and like, yeah, so, okay, these are the Tengus. Gotcha. That's them. That's the Tengus. These are the new peoples. That's a science ship. That's, that's a, that's a new, new civilization happening there. Are these the, uh, yeah, the artisan troop. Oh, what does this do? Um, fabulous. I do entrust you with one of our creations. It's sure to bring joy to the people of your empire. Do we going back? Sure. Why not? What's this do? Oh, yeah. No. Organize a festival. That's cool. Tell us more about your troop. The troop consists of several stations inhabited by creatives from any world, all unified in the desire to create new beauty in these safe havens. They bring their ideas and methods from all around the galaxy. Forgot he has a voice. And together we will find the ultimate expression of the self. We provide many services to those who wish to enjoy art. If you help sponsor our work, we might even be willing to organize larger events for your people. That's great. Um, what happens if you be... I don't want to become their patron. Goodbye. Cool. Good. Moving. Moving along. Starting to discover. Can arguably start moving up this way. But for right now... I'm good. I kind of want to get... Oh, what's, what's going on here? They're still suspicious of us. See, I can't even, like... Uh, what's... How's this going on? So, did the gather information thing just stop? Is that it? I'm assuming. It must have. Boy. So, we still don't know anything about them, though. Hunger. Well, this empire hungers and consumes. I don't know if I want to move closer to them yet, though. Because they're just going to come. At, they're just going to come at me like hard. That's why I'm moving these guys. Yeah, this. See, this is when they're away from a base. These guys cost a fuck a fuck ton. 
Um, can I create? Let me see. Yeah, my Corvettes can't, can't do shit. Ooh, I can have more though. Maybe I will. Maybe I'll add more to my to that fleet though. Or have a second fleet? We'll create a second fleet. So we'll do yeah, we'll do a second fleet of I can do sixteen more, so uh fleet manager. Let's do a, a second fleet. This shall be named the new fleet. <laughs> it's a new fleet. Where how do I I guess it's called New Fleet. Whatever. <laughs> uh, home base shall be... I mean... What's this one called? Uh, Hishamal. Yeah, let's, let's move them to Hishamal Station. Uh, back before I start watching the next episode of Circle. How goes it? It's, it's going. It's going. Yeah, we're going to have a Hishmal system be their home base. Assign to that base. We're going to add a ship design. And since we have 16 to play with, we can do, I guess, two missile, two support. So two defense, two support, which is, that's four. So 16 minus four is 12, and 12 Corvettes It's going to be, yeah. So we're going to do one, two. Oh, not. There you go. I'm going to do support. Two. And this we're going to do 12. There you go. Just 12. For now. That'll be 15. Oh, I can do... There you go. Wait, oh, that's the wrong way to do it. Hold on. How did that work? Yeah, I want the fire crest because these are the ones. Yeah, these are these are basic attack ships. Uh, Sixteen, right? Yes, sixteen. We can build nine. <laughs> I guess it's better than nothing right now. I mean, so let's do it, right? Yeah. Do it. Do it to it. They'll be building ships at Seoul, most likely. And Kazan Station. Star oh yes, because there's a shipyard there. Word, you're cruising. You're cruising. Probably won't be back before you end stream, so good night. Hey, good night, Piercer. Thanks for thanks for dropping by. A crash scout craft, a small scout craft of some kind, plowed into the surface of this asteroid millennia ago, creating a shallow canyon. There is no visible cockpit on the ship, leading our scientists to believe it was either piloted by remote or through some kind of primitive artificial intelligence. Though it is too damaged to be yet salvaged, uh, the ship hasn't been picked clean by looters yet. Nice. Galactic community has begun. That's great. That's what we want. So, several spacefaring empires. Reinforcements in transit. Great. Hmm. Spacefaring empires, some of them unknown to us, have banded together to form a galactic community. This supernatural institution is to serve as a forum where important matters can be discussed. Although we are not involved in its founding, the other members have extended an invitation to the United Imperium of Naboo for formal ne ne uh, membership. Should we accept this is what we've been waiting for? Eve, yes, let us join this community, and we shall make friends and grow our empire, and we shall become leaders within the community. We shall earn their trust and gain it and exploit it. Receiving communications. Look at this. Establish an embassy. Uh, sure. Establish an embassy. Sure. 
Um, I should also research how to form a federation. Uh, interesting. Assign an envoy to investigate. I don't have an envoy, though. That's the problem. The Krakens. Where are the Krakens? Won't you allow me to... Oh, communications have been established. All right, we're good. Good. So I'm assuming... So we're going to go now to over here. Oh, wow, there's already a bunch of proposals. So what's this one? Uh, the readied shield. Where are we? We are here-ish, right? Oh, yeah, we're... Not so high up the totem pole there. Look at these guys. These guys are strong. All right. Diplomatic weight from fleet power. Hmm. We're not going to have that... that big of fleet, though. My fleet power is... not that big. Naval capacity is up plus 10, though, which is good, but ship upkeep... No, oppose that shit. Screw that. Alright, what is this? This is... What's... what's What are we... Can, can we look to see? I assign an envoy? Yeah, might as well. Assign her. Need an envoy. There. Um. Yeah, we're opposing. Uh. Charter of workers' rights. Diplomatic weight from ops. Which we don't have a lot right now. Worker political power. I'm totally in favor of that. Uh, what's this? Tianqi Pest Control. Any empire with Tianqi inside their borders are in breach of galactic law. I don't know what this is. So the creatures are destroyed or leave of their own accord. Hmm. The Tianqi Conservation Act. That kills a Tianqi will be considered a breach of... I'm going to let that one go. I don't know. We're, we're going to not have to take a stance. Um, Senate floor. What about... Nobody's on the Senate because Senate's not in session. We are going to try to... Hmm. Cooperative research. And diplomatic weight from tech. Research station output. Starbase upkeep is up plus 5%. But diplomatic weight from tech. And I think we're doing pretty okay on the research. I know there are people who are from higher up than us, but we can we can kind of beat that. Divinity of life. Ooh, unity from gerbs. Spiritualist ethics attraction, but no. Space fauna. All right, well, yeah. Sanctions. But we do this. Fire is likely to support this resolution. I'm down with that. Yes, please. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the universe is dead, and all members of it should be ready to be de to defend their worlds, whether it be against players. Diplomatic weight from sp uh, fleet power, naval capacity is plus ten, but ship upkeep is plus five percent. I'm going to disagree with that. If it passes, whatever. But Now there's no crisis right now. Sanctions, defense, and war. Hmm. Change the galactic focus. Alright, and then for the greater good... All right, we got that already. Uh, all right, so the readied shield. Let's. It's already been proposed, but it doesn't say like what the support is. I guess. Mm. 
galactic community that are not vassals of another empire. They're using less than half of their naval capacity in breach. <laughs> really? Interesting. Uh, grants the counterattack has empires that are not galactic community members are in an offensive war. Mm hmm. It's the preemptive war, total war, cast the spell on empires that are not members of the... No, we're not going to do that. Rules of war. Guardian angels, diplomatic away from fleet power, defense, army, morale, army upkeep. Soldiers that dedicate their lives. <laughs> diplomatic weight from economy. Trade value. Bureaucratic upkeep. I feel like my economy's okay. <laughs> uh, so yeah, how about we do that? Already has a pending resolution. Oh, okay. So because I've pen I've done that already. Total diplomatic wave three fifteen United Imperium and a boo. Plus 347, that's great. Hmm. Okay. I think we're uh, I think we're okay here. Oh my wait, fleet power forty one pops. Yeah, actually, my pops is is probably my most important. It says diplomatic away from tech. Where's my tech? Tech is... Oh, tech is low. I don't want that, actually. Can I... Can I uh, take that one back, actually? <laughs> Fuck, I proposed it already. Motherfucker. Is there one? This is diplomatic... Wait from Pops. Okay, no, I've already voted for that one, so that's good. Tech is actually low for me. Oh well. Made a mistake. Uh, but eventually I want my tech to be better. So what I'm going to do is try to form... Uh, nope, they're a thing. Well, these guys. Forgel. And we do a with this empire this will increase the value of both empires trade networks, which would be good. Yeah, might as well, right? All positive relations or an envoy sent to improve relations. I don't have another envoy. I want to uh I want I want more envoys. How do I get more envoys? The slave market, but I can't participate in it. Um Policies, Let's edicts. We got any good ones that I can drop? Education campaign, leader experience gain. Sure, it's only a thousand. I have the monies. Uh, consumer of goods up is minus ten. So yeah, sure, we're gonna do that, and we're gonna do that. Clear blocker cost, clear blocker time, volatile ammunition, kinetic weapon damage goes up. Ooh. Do I even have? Do I even have those those resources? I'm not even sure. No, I don't. I don't. I don't have the uh, whatever it's called that I need. Uh, immigration poll. Pop growth from immigration. Ooh. Encourage political thought. That change in ethics. Starbase upgrade speed. Starbase capacity. Empire's Brawl from Systems plus 10. You know what? How is this? Oh, we're almost done. I don't even need that. I think we're going to do this one. Yeah. Receiving communications. That. Agree. 
Agree. Agree. Nice. Um, cold fusion. New generation of fusion reactors for yes, yes, please. Okay, we're we're cruising now, baby. Receiving communication. More communicate. More people. Everybody wants to be. I love this. All right, they're open in about a year. Receiving communications. Why haven't you built that research station yet? That's my question. Ooh, the Commonwealth of Man. Where's the Commonwealth? Oh, who are these guys? Ooh, they're really close to us. Oh, look at these guys. These guys are xenophiles, pacifists, spiritualists. Oh, word. Well, then, what we're going to do with them is... I don't have positive relations with them yet. Need more envoys, man. Species, leaders. Recruit. No. No. this architectural interest crime is down and leader lifespan actually can you know can we put Dolores Mwanga up there building cost district cost planetary build speed yeah how about uh, we move the governors yeah we're gonna do this planets and sectors we'll change that to Dolores Please. Our original, our original leader is now governor. We didn't, we didn't really need to worry about crime. We're a fairly peaceful thing, but now it should be cheaper to build shit on our planets. Um, great. Uh, and so with this, we should probably build a city. Uh, save in Hyrule. We want more pops. And boo. Well, we build a city there, too. Ooh, but we need amenities. That's alright, this creates amenities. Yeah, plus two amenities and plus two trade value, so that's good. And then uh, there's, oh, there's two more, okay. A regulatory f facilitation. Uh, cooperative Research Channels is receiving a lot of support, which is awesome. And Charter Workers' Rights, that's great. So, regulatory facilitation, diplomatic weight from the economy. Yeah, it's better than my tech, so I'll take that. Uh, worker pop resource, I have an ability. Yeah, no, that's yeah, that's fine. Let's do that. Uh, regulatory facilitation. We should leave regulatory decisions. Temple, what's up, buddy? Got to show you made a PSA for one of my classes. You did? Oh no. Um, so you made a PSA for one of your classes. That's cool. That's real cool, man. Uh, yes, regulatory facilitators decision to the experts. Industry leaders are the best qualified. I'm going to support that. <laughs> Very natal act. Yeah, diplomatic weight from fleet power minus 20. Uh, fleet power is all unknown on all these things. My fleet power is fairly weak. Uh, so that may actually soldiers defense army morale army upkeep I mean I'm gonna support that and then the, these I'm just gonna leave 
It's really this one, because I want I don't want the diplomatic weight from fleet power to be up. Then came out great. Gotta see it. I do gotta see it. Um can you send it to me via Discord or is is it up on the, the tubes, maybe? Hmm. Oh, my, my pops, yeah, my pops is my strongest weight. So if I can increase that by 20%, it's going to jump me up. Right now, middle of the road, but. Hmm. While conducting surface scans of Obuliava, science officer Amal Awali the, discovered what appears to be an artificially carved slab of rock covered in alien writing. Translate the situation log updated. Great. Be for now. That continues to run. Complete. Good for you. That's unclaimed, but there's monies and minerals there to be claimed. Uh, we're actually good for right now. Rare crystals. Who are you? Who asteroid fossils? Fossils from what appear to be several species of aquatic animals have been found in the barren. Nice. Uh, where are you guys? You guys are just. Are you hanging around there? know what you're going to do? You're actually going to go this way. Yeah, you guys are actually going to go to this thing. Enter orbit. Um, same with you guys. Second fleet. Can I reinforce you yet? Fleet manager, maybe? No, not yet. They're nowhere near their strongest, but... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Can I upgrade first? So you guys need to upgrade. You guys need to upgrade. And you need to upgrade? This thing needs to upgrade. Nice, nice, nice. Star system charted. Star system charted. Vessels upgraded. Nice. These guys, I don't know where they're going. They're going to upgrade, but... Oh yeah, they're, they're at Kazan. Okay, cool. Which is a shipyard. Receiving communications. Ooh, Jesus. Okay. Great. What's what's work? Charter for his rights. Awesome. And where's the one that? No, the what the, the charter for his rights is what they're voting on. No, cooperative research channels. The one that I, the one that I suggested, and everybody is supporting it except for the Log and Choose Nation. Yeah, we want this because I want diplomatic weight from tech, which is you know my tech's not great of a research station output is plus 10%, which is the faster you can research, the better. And then I guess we'll move to that. So, moving towards that, good. That's moving. That's moving and grouping. Senate's now in session. Fleet has been upgraded. Great. Good, good. And what is this? A commercial pact invitation. Uh, this will increase the value of both Empire's trade networks. Please. Absolutely. I like when my trade is higher. Look at my, my trade is only 29 right now. That's weird. Should be higher. But okay. Yeah, it's, it's just everybody's... Ooh, people are abstaining. What is this about? Our leader has gained a new level, Dolores Mwanga. 
potentially continental size 12 continental world if i really wanted to i could colonize that as well are you done oh you're still surveying all right keep going keep going what is this translate alien mural scientist is present how about you And then research that and then we can send you back to do these Have you going that way? You do I want you to build that? Mm, we could. Let's wait a little bit. We don't need to do it right yet. Alien drag racing. The crater on um, exhibits long irregular marks printed in the relatively soft upper layers of the asteroid. Science officer Amal Alawi has recovered some interesting unexpected wreckage from the edges of the depression. Wheeled vehicles, seemingly personal transports rather than research craft. The crew of the UNS Copernicus speculate that the crater may once have been used for sport, with some alien species pitting their personal locomotion devices against each other in the tests of mechanical strength of speed in near zero g. Hmm, that's the skid marks modifier. Which is plus six. Ooh, tech research. A scientist who died. No. Can I go to? Jeez. So we got a recruit. She's surveying. Anomaly discovery chance. That's good. Research speed. Do that. gonna have the yeah this they're they're all at the level they're all at the age that they're gonna start dying now this first generation of people that i've had cool temple i'll have to look at it after this star system charted word so you're gonna start doing this you've uh yeah, you've reached the thing, but you're just eager. Okay. Now you're going to go research those anomalies for me. Technology secure. Nice. Noise. Hmm. Tomb World Habitability. Ready, we will allow our settlers to colonize worlds that have been devastated by nuclear warfare. Well, here's the problem, though, right? Are there any tomb worlds whatsoever around? I'll remain as valid option until research. So do we have, I could just, Starbase Capacity, Planetary Capital. Hall of Judgment, I love it. Uh, administer, administrators produce... Unity and amenities. Do I have a planetary capital? A planetary administration. Hmm. Hmm. Enforcers produce unity. Decrease crime and spawn defense armies. Jobs based production. 17 unity. Ooh, yeah, 7 unity is great though. Maybe I will do one of those. Do that. That's great. So speaking of, can I... Can't upgrade that, right? Yeah, I'm assuming the planetary administration goes to planetary capital and it'll it'll be able to upgrade because now Hyrule... I can upgrade this to planetary administration, which produces more unity. Uh, you, not yet. And there's buildings that can be built because the cities have been built. But the empire is growing nicely. 
Oh, you have no orders because, uh, can I get yeah, keep surveying that system, please? And then survey that system. Star system charted. Star system charted. Um, where are you guys going? Ooh. A large portion of asteroid CO9. Hmm. Nice. Technology secured. Ooh, that was quick. Alright, so this is just cruising. We need you to go here. Because you're fucking killing me with your... Enter that orbit. Same here. You are going to go here. Enter orbit there. Because you're killing me with these fucking, you know, costs of, like, ships. Th th 38. Because you're not sitting around a fucking starbase, right? You're just eating up fucking resources. Yeah, 12 wanted. That needs to increase as well. And it will in a second. I oh, need that. Archaeological site discovered. Oh, interesting. Is that it? There if there's a construct designed to mimic a natural asteroid. Interesting. And then technology research. Nice. Uh, afterburners. Ooh, ooh, yeah, we need to get some robot workers to start uh, working into forges and the mains. Uh, robots. Robots is good. That'd be great for our economy. We really do need that. Um, so, because of this, right? Details, yes, you have fusion missiles now, which is awesome. Let's see, what is this? This is, ooh, a 1.7, and then I'm going to put another 1.2 strength fleet around it. I could actually put another fence station there. Maybe I will. 99, yeah, it'll be worth it. Do that. This, is, this has to, because that's kind of their entry point into our empire. Unless they're going to go that way. This is their entryway. Um, and this fleet here... Can I just reinforce for now? Special project complete. Hey! Uh oh Amazing! Let's see, what's it do? A science officer, Amar Alawawi, has managed to partially translate the alien mural discovered on Ubeleva. It is a memorial for an extinct alien race that once maintained a small interstellar empire in the region of the galaxy. They were apparently exterminated by the creators of the mural, a fact that they seem to regret. Given that the mural has been dated to be in excess of 300 million years old, it is likely that its creators are also extinct by now. Perhaps most interesting of all is the material that the mural was made of. Despite its age, it is in remarkably good condition. What? Okay, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> uh, that's amazing. Give us that research. What is this? Who's getting... Who, who are you getting fired at by? Suddenly received a glancing hit by several passing mass gyros. Our checkdowns were billions of years old and based on their trajectory, they appear to be stray rounds fired from a neighboring galaxy. After missing their intended target, they continued on their journey for untold millennia until today. The rounds we have recovered are of an advanced design despite their incredible age. Well, that's just fucking lucky. Oh, wow. Lagan Chu, tectonically unstable world of the Lagan Chu Z. Jesus, look at that. Um, 
has finally exploded. Its eventual destruction had long been predicted by the Lagan Shu's nation. A disorganized evacuation effort saved some of their citizens, but the majority seemed to have still been on the planet's surface when it disintegrated around them. The projected death toll is catastrophic. Fate can be cruel. Well, that's, I guess, what you get. Mm. Wow. Okay, so now we need to r another fucking scientist. Record. Uh, research speed in computing. Star Can we please stop? Charted. Research speed in new worlds, just anomaly discovery chance, I guess. Jeez. Yeah, none of these fucking work. I guess... Maybe what we'll do is, yeah. We'll recruit this one. I'm gonna take her off of there. She can't do anything. Or this guy can't do anything more. Cancel. I don't want to dismiss... How do I take him to leaders, right? Take this guy. Can't remove a leader on a research mission. Motherfucker. <laughs> uh, busy commanding. Archaeology excavation speed. Busy leading society research. Well. All right, you know what? For now, fuck it. We're going to have to do this for now, and then we'll change it later. Good, rivalry is ended, system surveyed. Uh, can I see what these guys want? Oh, Jesus. On closer examination, it's declared, uh, so, okay. On closer examination, Cthulhu Collector. Greetings, Zeno scum. Well, hello, Cthulhu Collector. How are you on this fine evening? On closer examination, we have discovered that a smaller, consisting almost entirely of precious metals, recently collided with 41 CV399. This small but dense cache of metals was hidden just beneath the asteroid's surface. But now it has been discovered it should be accessible to mining. Oh, a lucky find. Slow enough at work that I can watch Twitch. That's awesome. Wow, you're working. What uh, what time is it where you are? It's 11.10 here. It's, I'm, I'm an East Coast. East Coast gang represent. Jesus, pause. Fuck. <laughs> hmm. Is there anything I can do? These guys really like me. Uh, yeah. And these guys, uh, faction support. Support of those brothers this faction support. It's increased by the amount of pops in the faction. The full enfranchisement. What do they want? These guys don't like me. Enclaves Incorporated. No, oh, yeah, whatever. Free anti autocratic free movement. Good reproductive freedoms. Cool and anti certification. Yeah. Whatever, we're cool. 10, 10 p.m. Oh, okay, not bad. I got friends in your time zone. You're good. Uh, peace offer. Just making peace all over the place. Commonwealth of Man, the Zathorium. Wow, so many wars. Oh, boy. Receiving communications. These guys are weird. Sure. You playing a pre-gen or one of your own? Uh, one of my own. So this is uh, the, the thing that I'm doing, right, since Nemesis came out. And with the, uh, um, you know, idea that you can become the custodian, right? Uh, I am a fan of the Star Wars. And I am playing the game uh, role-playing Sheev Palpatine, right? So every decision I make, I make as Sheev. Um... 
Emperor Palpatine, if you will, from Star Wars. Uh, so we are, our home world is Naboo. I created just a kind of what I would picture to be the Nabooian kind of civilization, because uh, Sheev's home world was Naboo. Uh, and kind of imagining every every decision that I make, what would Sheev do in that instance? It actually worked out pretty good for me earlier on. Um, when I was uh, performing a espionage action against these guys here, and I uh, uh, was faced with the decision to make, I made Sheev's decision, and it ended up working out real good. So it's 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 kind of fun. Um, it's it's a good time thus far. Uh, I had to I had to restart at one point because, um, like very like the, my first night playing. I got unlucky and had I, I was cleansed within like just the first couple years of the game. So I was like, all right, we're just restarting. <laughs> um, we need to do this again. Relative by their power is roughly evenly matched ours. Word. Cool. Um, can we launch that? I need to find out what these guys are packing. Because they contacted me and said, we're going to eat you. And so I've just kind of been, like, building up my forces here. So, yeah, I have a pretty good kind of, like, stronghold sitting in this kind of choke point right here. Because if they're going to come at me, that's where they're going to come at me. So, yeah, let's keep, let's keep moving forward. I believe this is something that I've proffered. So it looks like... Gaining support. So every game I am in, next to one of the never friendly empires. That's well. That's that's how it happened to me. My first game. It was one of those like super powerful empires that like there's no way you can build up a fleet to fight them that early on, and it was it was unnecessary. Now the let's see these guys um, I'm next to. They're pacifists. I don't got to worry about them. I have a defensive pact with these guys, so I'm good. These guys fucking hate me, though. Um, and, yeah, these guys are dismissive, but they're, they're a stagnant empire, so I just don't need to worry about them, either. It's really just these guys that I gotta worry about. Play a full game, been going to mid-game, just figuring out what's changed. Um, I don't, I haven't even made it to mid-game yet, so we're just here, let's see, Galactic Community was just founded. Uh, so let's see, it looks like uh, the voting is going to be... Ooh, what is this? Tevador, oh boy. For several months now, we have received scattered reports of small numbers of alien mercenaries and privateers operating on the frontiers of our space. They call themselves the Tevadoran and are apparently exiles from a nomadic warrior culture inhabiting overcrowded space stations in and around the D-471 Singularity System. I don't even know where the fuck that is. Um, I don't think it's anywhere close to me. I don't think I even need to worry about it. The passage near our space proceeded without incident, but they warned us against trespassing in D-471 Singularity. There is no Tepidoran uh, central government to speak of. Attempt to contact them. Look at these fucking guys. <laughs> Trying out different starts. Cyan got an even bigger boost. Oh, so they start with a wormhole into their fallen empire's space. Ooh, that's pretty cool. I got lucky um, in, a, in uh, a game that I'm playing off stream. Um, and I believe I have a wormhole within my empire. And again, I'm just I'm just democratic race of humans. Uh so you it seems like i'm getting fairly lucky this one is kind of kind of vanilla i don't have anything fancy yet um i do have a pulsar here that has an, a, a clock ticking down to the year 2300 um so i got 60 years to worry about it before i got to worry about it so who knows what that's going to indicate uh, I got a black hole, and I, I, I haven't even, like, completely filled out my empire yet, either. That's the thing. What do you want, foolish Dwamak? What happened to make you, uh, face look like that? Reactor accident? Vacuum exposure? Hey, look at you! We are the Tebadoran. We hunt Dwamak. If you come to Tebadoran, Turf, we make Dwamaks too. Not good for you, yes? Oh, these guys are annoying. Shit. 
Perhaps you know other Dwamax. Perhaps you want them to be Dwamax too. This can be arranged. Tap it around. Not above fight. Oh. Okay, so they're like mercenaries. Good to know. 3,100 hours in this game and now get to relearn stuff again. Isn't that isn't that kind of cool though? Like the fact, like think about it. Any other game that that would have been out for as long as this game has, right? You you would it would have been old hat. It's almost like get in. It's kind of like, but now it's like a new pair of jeans or something like that, right? You get to slip them on and like work them back in again. Get to rediscover some of the economic redos and rehashes. Oh shit, uh, we need gerbs. Uh, oh boy, okay, jobs, gerbs, gerbs. What kind of gerbs should I give uh, Hyrule? Burp, burp, burp. Oh, we need monies. We'll do that. Okay, well. Yeah. 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 Should I do monies? Ernax doesn't know how to get to, to the money between this. Uh, the CK. I have not played Crusader Kings or uh, Europa Universalis yet, um, but I'm very interested in them. Uh, this was my first foray into Paradox. I've also played the Surviving Mars, which is also pretty cool. Um, and today I just got um, Frostpunk. I don't know if you ever heard of that. I'm gonna want to try streaming that one of these nights too, because that's that I've seen that gameplay before, and that's pretty cool. Oh, did they really? The Paradox Paradox knows what they're doing with their with their four four X games. That's for sure. But it's, it was on, it's on sale on Steam. In case you're a, oh, thank you so much. I appreciate that. I really do. And uh, Jeremiah Johnson appreciates it as well. Uh, but we're uh, we're looking to, um, you know, the 4X games. I'm really into them. I don't really have many friends that are into them, so I kind of just play them myself. <laughs> but I'm okay with that. It's cool. You know. You know, we're going to build a building. We need gerbs. We need gerbs. And maybe... Naboo. Yeah, you know what? We're going to do that. Give them soldier jobs, right? Why not? The stronghold upkeep is one, one energy. Ugh. I need energy, though. All right, we're going to do this. Uh, features. Why can't I? 3.8. 17 of 19 total districts. Oh, well, that makes sense. This can have more features. Oh, I gotta clear some of these. Max agricultural districts. Yeah, we're gonna just build one of these. That's what we're gonna do. I guess everyone should have one of these, these kind of doodads. Yeah, I need clerks anyways. So do uh, do many people know who that is without being told? I got that movie on. Uh, what do you mean? Um, Steve Palpatine? Is that is that who you're talking about? Or Cthulhu? <laughs> Keep cruising. Oh, Jeremiah Johnson. <laughs> Um, honestly, I'm not sure. I know a lot of people are familiar with the GIF. Um, Jemima, Jemima Johnson. Jemima Johnson is a much different character. They actually, you know, they, they retconned her into Jeremiah Johnson. <laughs> Jemima Johnson, you know, as opposed to going to Alaska to hunt grizzly, she went to Alaska to make syrup. <laughs> Oh boy, uh, no, Jeremiah. Yeah, I don't. I don't know because it's. I've seen the movie. Obviously, I, I actually lo like it. It's a really good movie. Um, but no, I don't. I don't know if many people know if that's the character's name of Jeremiah Johnson, right? And it's of course it's like from a scene of the movie that's like really cool, and then right after that the movie gets real sad. Uh, 
spoilers, he loses his kids. <laughs> his kid and his wife. But that's a... Uh, no, I don't think I don't think most people. I would put money on them not necessarily knowing who Jeremiah Johnson is. Shipyard, oh word, 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 word. Situation cool. Updated. Where's that? Up here, I'm assuming. Is this it? Yes. Repair the automated shipyard. So can you actually just do that, please? Oh, I need a construction ship. Word, word. word. I have like. Construction ships that aren't doing anything, so please do that. You are gonna. Um, oh, you're done doing that? Well, can you maybe. What's your. Your leader cost is. Oh, well, actually, since you're done doing that, what I want to do to you is. Because you can do Anomaly Discovery Chance doing that. Yes. And then I'm going to take you and put you in. Here we go. See? I think you're the one that does excavations, right? Yeah, your excavation speed is faster. So how about this? How about you come down here and do this for me? God damn it. <laughs> Alright, don't worry about that for now. What you're going to do is because your anomaly discovery chance is fairly high. Let's go this way. And I want you to kind of... Mm, yeah. Survey that system. Why am I, like, bleeding money? What the hell is happening? Not for long. Once I once I get those energy districts up, I should be fine. There it is. Yeah. There there we go. We're better now. Watch a lot of movies. Kind of forced to watch westerns as such by my parents. John Wayne and Clint Eastwood western along with anything close that was... Eh, my grandfather loved all of the John Wayne westerns. Um, and I I used to watch them with him when I was a kid. Just because they were fun and stupid. Um, uh, I love the, the Dollars trilogy with Clint Eastwood. I haven't really watched much more of his western movies outside of that, though. But they are... They're like top-notch fucking films. Um... Shipyard. Oh, you can upgrade that. Yes, please. What's this? Apprehended by Hunter. I've just been alerted to her. Oh, boy. And our operatives have earned the attention of local Hunter Seeker drones. Son of a bitch. It is not truly jeopardized yet, but spy might require speedy assistance. We must trust in diplomacy. One, one of one options, the event snuffed out happens. There's 100% chance of the event of snuffed out happens. Uh, there's... Starry. Oh, she's gonna die. Uh, boy. There it is. The team of operatives near has missed a number of checkpoints. Uh, given the nature of this operation, we had already anticipated them being unable to maintain frequent contact. However, a spy master is regrettably confident that by now, the team has been lost. Operation Gather Information may be rescued if we can successfully cover our tracks, pitting our code breaking against their encryption. Uh, let's see, there is a medium to low chance our actions will go unnoticed. <laughs> or we can disavow. Oh boy. What would Sheev do? Right? So Sheev is Sheev recognizes that the other has a better chance. And wants to go unnoticed, and he wouldn't necessarily really care about leaving like, like casualties behind. Dis disavow their presence. We do not know them. They are in the wind. Success is more likely if we have an asset assigned to this operation, sharing some primary. Nope, just disavow them. They accuse us of hostile espionage. Their claims that we sent operatives to conduct abhorrent acts of aggression against them are built upon shaky and misattributed evidence. 
Whatever the credibility or reasoning behind this allegation, it has resulted in a diplomatic sanction from the Rosvaro. I can't say that word. Raveners. We are not likely to see any direct consequences from this, but it's unlikely the SMU will go unnoticed by any of their allies or even our own. Unfortunate. Well. Vessels upgraded. Uh, okay, they made peace. Our fleet is upgraded. Ooh, and we have a new election underway. She's got plenty of support. I think she's going to win. I don't even need to support her. Yeah, we're good there. Don't even need to worry about it. She's got 50% support. Construction ship, science ship. What are you doing? You're just sitting there bored? Oh, you're done doing that. Word. Okay, so... Maybe. Yes. No. Wait. No, stop. Um, what are you doing? You're going that way. You go this way. How much would it do just to? Unclaimed system. Hold on. Can I? It'd be expensive. But I can do it. <laughs> Slow them down, I guess. I do this one, though. Paint it's 67 and 90. And then that's 67 and 90, 67 and 90. Um... But yeah, let's do it. This is going to be kind of like our outpost. I don't care. I'm not going to really put much there except those resources. Um, but this is kind of our, our line of defense here. And that's where that's where we're stationed. We're going to put the, you know, defenses up all along. This is going to be our Manginot line, right? Like in World War I. This is going to be our Manginot line for these guys. They're going to have to, like, plow through these systems. Um, or at least go through this one and get some damage. Uh, before going on and hopefully we can at least take a couple of them out so we'll see maybe if we're able to build another um a station out here we can move up because that is a potentially habitable world too continental which is nice Ooh, what is this a weak oh it's weak magnetic field oh, it's 15 though Ooh, that that'd be a great forge world though this one what's this one got so much of anything. Nothing really fancy. And nothing fancy there either. So they will just go through Space Belgium to get you. <laughs> well, that's the thing. If this is my Manginal line, this would be Belgium. So, yes, I'm so glad you got that reference. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, my God. They would absolutely. They would, they, you know, they. that's where... If... World War One was a bar fight, right? Germany looks at France, punches Belgium. <laughs> uh, that's exactly what would happen. But that's going to be it. We're going to do that. And, um... You know, in the meantime, how about you survey these systems, too? That way we know at least what's there. And I believe well, there's people abstaining, and I wonder why. Hey. Oh, wow, Dolores Mwanga won. Interesting. For details on their mandate. Okay, and our planetary districts have expanded. Great. Resolution, the Senate has voted and passed in resolution cooperative research channels. Great. Great, great, great. And what is this? This one, diplomatic weight from economy. What is my economy, honestly? It's my diplomatic weight from economy. Is uh, okay. My pops is higher, though, which is kind of why I want this one to go up. Um, so if I vote this one down, I should be able to get... Oh, for the Galactic Market. And that's a good one, too. 
I'll support that. I kind of want trade value to go up, which is great, but my economy... Oh yeah, my economy's alright. Their economy is 112. And then their economy is 116. Shit. Okay, you know what? We're gonna vote this one down for right now. We're already supporting that. No, we're not. We're voting against that one. I would like this one to go ahead. resolutions. What's the next one? So we got that one, right? The weak support. Mm. Mm. Which should be proposed next. Sanctions, politics, and culture. No. Galactic reforms. Empire's like this is the sovereignty of Great Gore. Form a Galactic Council. Remember, the council begins with the powers to push emergency members, propose sanction revolutions, and denounce. I mean, maybe so the Galactic Gore. Who are the Galactic Gore? Well, they have some weight. Hmm. If I side with them right now, they're okay. How does one get more envoys? I know it's, it's so weird to all of a sudden need. Yes, who would have thought that? Well, that's I only have three. How do I need? How do I how do I increase that? I only have three. I feel like there's got to be a way to increase this. Because look, he's 77, 81, 68. Like she's gonna die. <laughs> she's absolutely gonna die. Can I? Because I would love to maybe improve relations. And these guys were real friendly with, right? I can't do that because they're just all consciousness. Whatever. Got a machine up there up to six. That that would be awesome if I had six envoys. I only got the three. And the one isn't doing me much good over here. Oh, I can... Oh, word, 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 word. All right, so... Starbase damage. Yes. See? Increase my defenses right now. Ship upkeep reduced by 10. Naval capacity increased by 20. Um, Starbase damage first. A yes. A great game. Tax, yeah, okay, some empire traits. The machine diplomacy as one federation choice gives plus one to robots. Oh well I am I am researching the robot thing. So we're good there. Hmm. Good. Good. Yeah, so that's I got the three. And I think I'm gonna I might have to just recall her because again, she's not really doing much. So cease activity within this spy network, allowing its spy master to be reassigned while also preventing its infiltration level from decaying. So maybe acquire an asset. These are hard though. My text that I should do. And yeah, we need jobs here. Do some research. Speed up some research. That's what we're gonna do.
and there's buildings and we need amenities and so we are going to do that increases unity and amenities and having more immunity a unity is always a good thing uh, but the upkeep is two we are consuming a lot right now which I don't understand why exactly Ooh, I don't have a... well, that, that may make sense. Prime, leave us... well, that's the only one we got. Why are you just sleeping? Why aren't you in orbit around this station? There we go. That will reduce your upkeep cost. Yeah, I was going to say, there there was a reason why that, that like, dropped. They're all sitting next to the station, but they're not in, in an orbit. Uh, I'm not sure normal empires get plus one envoy for picking from Federation trade. Federations themselves give an extra envoy to the presence. So that's, I was thinking of maybe trying to form a Federation, but I don't have that, uh, what's it called, um, tradition yet. I may go that next Either that or prosperity, improve, improve my, or discovery to get that kind of research going. Yeah. One new set of text and increasing gravity. Yeah, one of the that's and I've been anytime I see one of those options that says it, it'll lead down that tree, I try to I try to take it. Everybody seems to be doing something. They're good. Um researching, researching. These guys can upgrade? Is that it? Three ships will be upgraded. Yep. And then these guys as well. Upgrade, and I believe I can reinforce. Technology secured. Word. So does the whole fleet need to go to get upgraded? Nice, now I can get robots when I get it. Ooh, the star hold. As space giant larger and more defensible star are need to maintain control over system space lanes. Yes. Yes, they are indeed. I don't need minerals, right? Good. Good. Yeah, they're gonna go back and upgrade. Special project complete. Hmm. An automated shipyard. The facility may resume its interrupted construct using what materials it had on hand to build an advanced frigate of unknown design. Yes. Upgraded. Fortunately, the ancient facility broke down um, completely afterwards and has been deemed beyond repair. We have a new ship. And it is here. What is it? What do we got? Oh, a frigate. The UNS Dark Wanderer. Antimatter missiles, medium X ray lasers. And a barrier point defense. Ooh. I'm going to throw that in with my second fleet. So can you... Bind? Merge. Yes.
Ooh, wow. The food has dropped all of a sudden. So with you... Construction because you're the one that complete. has all of these. Same with you. Star system charted. Technology secured. Good. Good. Noise. Which means they all need to be upgraded again. <laughs> no. Oh. Ooh. Arrays of defense will prove much more effective than independent countermeasures. Hmm. I think we're going to go do this. This is more useful and faster. And my fleets need to be upgraded again. Uh, Treya, that was home to a small Vatalum outpost where they traded with several neighboring civilizations. At some point, the trade outpost appears to have been converted into a religious mission where the Vatalum attempted to convert visiting alien merchants to their philosophy trade ceased shortly afterwards and the plant was eventually abandoned. Trading post. Situation log updated. Um, situation log. Too angled. Yeah, precursors, the Voltium trading post. Yeah, we're going to do that. So where is that? Ah, yes. So you are actually going to do this first. Since you're right there. Vessels upgraded. Trade deal duration expired. Okay, well, that's fine. Good, 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 good. Senate is now in session. Buzzword standardization. Well, whatever. I guess. Might as well vote for it. Vessels upgraded. Special project complete. Uh, digital pamphlet. Altium artifacts. Good. Great. Grand. Then you keep going this way. There we go. Keep cruising. Construction ship. You're not really doing much of anything, are you? Oh god, these fleets. Alright, I need you and you. Go there. Star system charted. Ooh. How about you now? Communications. Research these anomalies.
A gigantic skeleton. Situation log updated. Yes, please. Uh, uh, oh boy. Log and choose nation. Really? Why? What are you doing? You're pacifists. Hmm. Oh boy, am I going to have to go to war with them now? Good. Oh boy. do have the log and choose nation receptive they have a cast a spelly on all of these people but we have I thought we had a non-aggression pact You're fucking pacifists. And you're xenophiles. Oh, they don't like robots. That's why. Because they're religious. Alright, here's the thing. Should I... Okay, I gotcha. Oof. Oh, boy. Um, yeah. More industrial districts, please. Have to. No, actually, I gotta wait, because we need fucking money. You guys are in, and it's okay, but... Still negative five, so... Yeah. Alright, then what you're doing... Building mining stations, that'll help a lot, actually. <laughs> we have been implicated in a plot against the Thor... What? I just really state whether or not they are on to something. Our own spies protest that allegations is baseless, claiming this is likely either a defensive counter-espionage response from one of our targets or else a smear campaign being conducted by some third party. They're the reason a cause the Thor Alliance have taken offense. Great. Thorquil Alliance. Well, oh, they're way the fuck up here. Don't really gotta worry about them. We have a bunch of shit going on with them. Like, we're they're neutral to us, but... They are improving our relations. How's this chick doing down here? Commercial pack broken. Why? Right, we no longer do. No, okay, thank you. That's great. It was monies that I was enjoying. With these guys. Make a commercial pack with them, maybe? Democratic Crusaders, Fanatic, Egalitarian. Uh, yeah, so these guys are actually fairly similar to us. Hmm. Another empire. First, we just acquire an asset. Be nice. Jeez, nine hundred. Four hundred, nine hundred. Uh, 
Now, who was the who was the smear campaign? Who did that to us? Special project complete. Nice. Astounding. I don't have. We're just losing monies now. This is fucking great. How does? Does it make sense? Just like hemorrhaging money. Star system charted. Ooh, okay. An association status by the Cosmic Pact. <laughs> Feel like should uh, research those fucking generator buildings when I had the chance. Oh well. Fuck that one up. Do when I get it. When I see it coming next time. What is this? There's a new one. Cover it fallen. Oh, okay. Wait from the economy. Because my economy isn't great. Plenty of pops. But... Now I'm only losing two per month. That's not terrible, I suppose. Hmm, what are you doing? All that or nothing, right? You're researching. You're researching. Your survey. Construction complete. Hey, good. Positive monies again. Great. <laughs> um, I need something to yes. I can't because you can only do one per world. Consumer goods. Or drop. It's like fluctuating though. I don't understand. I don't understand why it's fluctuating so wildly. I would like a research agreement. All right, let's do this. Um, it's still good. Policies. Economic policy? We're in a mixed. Hmm. 
I like having those alloys right now, though. Robots are going to be we servitude. We don't want we don't want them to know so because I don't need them consuming consumer goods. Best way to, to contact them all. Um, can't make anything with them. There we go. Why? Why are they dropping with us? We have a defensive pack with them. But we don't have anything with these guys. Bounded. New faction, Committee of Technological Progress. The advancement of the sciences. Well, I'm down with that. War declaration. Oh boy. I believe that means we're at war with them too. I think. Uh, okay, no, 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 we're not at war with them, which is good. Uh, they declared war, so they didn't call in our allies, which is, which is good. Star system charted. Hey, okay, now you're going to be moving there. Oh, thank God. Let's reduce ship upkeep, please. Should help. There it is. Now we need consumer goods. Technology secured. Hey. Ooh. Ooh. Planetary FTL inhibitors. Plasma thrower? What does that do? Field damage. Does a lot of armor damage and hull damage. Holy shit. I'm assuming you replace uh, uh, lasers. They do even less damage. Uh, planetary FTL inhibitor. There's at least one stronghold or fortress. We'll be able to inhibit the FTL drives of hostile fleets, which is good. Unlock component star, be star base FTL inhibitor. inhibitor. Hmm. Uh, 
Unless they destroy the starbase. That's the idea. I feel like that's a good thing. That way they can't just cruise by. Hmm. What's the uh, current meta on these things? Purple lasers, which do tend to... Well, it's a small, right? Tend to 27. Hmm. It also does uh, plus 50% hull damage and plus 100% armor damage. Kinda want them. Kinda want them. Expensive, though. Maybe I'll put them on my star bases instead. And also, this one this one first I think yeah what needs to be upgraded on these things old fusion oh the purple they're going to the purple laser yeah. Only a hundred. Let's move these guys down to do it first. Then I'll move them back and move first fleet in. Dark Ponderer. Interesting looking ship. Oh boy. I'm just waiting for these guys to fucking declare a war on me. mission listen you are going to research that project Like midnight here. I've been playing for what are we what are we going on now? Two and a half hours. That is quite a bit. I'm thinking. Need to plan out my next move. They're like catching some shit. Hundred days until this passes. I'm going to vote for it. It's winning. Yeah. 
Trade value goes up, which means more monies for me. Because I believe, yeah, 38. There it is. Oh, upgraded. Then you... Go back into orbit around that there, please. And then you... Go get upgraded. Good. Um, diplomatic communication. Oh, they're they're closing their borders to us. I haven't been moving around in your territory. I'm moving up in the world, which is great. Number four. These guys are still real strong. Would love to improve relations with these guys. And my, my robotic neighbors next door... What is that? Infiltration progress. Oh, okay, that's fine, yeah. Like before 22. Can I, um. Immortal. It's nice. I'd like to be immortal. Alright, we have a defensive pack. We have a research agreement. We have. They have a favor from us. I would like to change. What am I doing? What is going on? Thank you. I would like to... Nope. Fuck. We'll just do this. These guys. I want to make friends with these guys. So, let's send this guy, who's 83 years old. He's going to die soon. <laughs> All of these are going to die soon. Uh... these guys I don't Stars really need to improve charted. relations with these guys anymore hey the core of the basic Baltimore time unit nice research those anomalies and then keep going And then yeah. you're just doing a whole lot of nothing right now, aren't you? How about you? You could start with this one. And then move to no this one. And then move to this one. Thorquil Alliance. Who's the Thorquil Alliance? Oh, these guys. Mm -hmm. The dominant vault to neighboring so its message speaks the need to disconnect to embrace true existence. Situation interesting. Updated. Find what that means, please. Who's the sovereignty of Great Gorf? Where are they? What are my relationship with them? Mm 
Hmm. A trade deal. What if? Communications. And we give a favor. Who are they? Hegemonic imperialists. Military. Okay. Uh, but these guys. Democratic crusaders. Distinguished admiralty. Warrior culture. Void dwellers. Ooh. They're strong. Yeah, their tech is much superior. I would love to get a tech thing with them, but... You guys hate me for some reason. I have no idea why. They would cash this belly on us? Hmm. Because of our ideology. Hmm. Weird. Weird. But okay. That's fine, I guess. Let's. Uh, okay. I'm starting to learn more about these people. Operation phase. Hey, hey, Spymaster reports from the uh, successful execution so far. Spy Network has secured access to a modified Isvarana drone, the benefits of which will be obvious whenever we m might wish to infiltrate or otherwise manipulate the Ravener's entity. Excellent. Excellent, excellent, excellent. So we spent a lot of the infiltration level, I guess. But we have an asset now. Mm hmm. So I wonder if. It expired. Oh, okay, good. Age campaign has expired. Okay. 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 Before. Difficulty is still six. Hard difficulty. Well, I mean, I have to know what what they're what they're capable of. Watch. We have to know. Yeah. Temple, it's bedtime for me. Let me know how you like the video. I will, Temple. I absolutely will. Vessels upgraded. Ooh. Wow. Asilius. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. That is, uh, that's very, very nice. It's very nice. Did you just pop in or have you been here? A rough night, dude. Hope that, well, you know what? That is, that is some goodwill that you have just sent out into the universe. And I will promise to pass it along. That is... That's you're you're good with me, dude. You really are. That is uh I'm gonna pass that 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 good that goodwill along. I like that. 
Well, I hope uh, I hope your subsequent nights are better. It's it's a good game. I have to say, it's hard. <laughs> it's very hard, but it is a good game. It really is. It's enjoyable as shit. Um, and uh, just kind of do your research, I guess, because um, a lot of shit has changed. So really, if you find if you're doing if you're looking up stuff and you're looking up YouTube videos, um, it's <laughs> try to look for stuff that that's come within the past week because anything older than that is actually out of date. <laughs> um, but again, I really appreciate it. I really do. There's clear evidence that a massive space battle took place in close to orbit of Usaldan 3A at some point in the last 5,000 years. The surface on one side of the moon is pockmarked with craters from stray weapons blasts, and scans from the UNS Noble have picked up several hooks on the ground. Though these wrecked ships are all in very poor condition, the fact that anything remains at all after the damage they must have sustained is a testament to their advanced design. Science officer Sat Sota Gato is preparing an expedition to sift through these derelict hulls for any valuable technologies. Let's go there. Uh, situation log updated. And you're, you don't, don't fly away. You're going to go there first. You're just going to do that. Don't fly away. Special project complete. Another one. After careful analysis, have a great night. I'm going to crash out. Thanks for... The... Hey, cheers to you, man. Have a good night. After careful analysis, the Voltaim transmitter array are archaeologists and data engineers. Uh, have concluded that the machinery does not contain any technologies of value to us. The project has greatly improved our understanding of the primary Voltaim programming language. However, this will hopefully make it easier to decipher the data in the future. Alright, so how many of those Voltaim things have we collected at this point? Three. Okay, we need... So those three have been completed. I need to try to... And then maybe a lot of anomalies to get through. So yeah, so there's two more there. One, two. That one's being. Oh, two. Where's that one? Right, so this, yeah, you're researching that one. That's got to be one there too. What are you doing? I don't have anybody who has, like, speeded up anomaly research speed or whatnot. So, neutral log and shoes. What's weird is you've closed the borders to me, yet your shit is flying all in here. How about, um... How about you get on out? What did I want to... No. Uh, no. Oh, relics. There it is. Yeah, that's what I wanted. Discover a precursor insight to learn location of a precursor site. 55, how many? I have 57 of those things. Uh, celebrate diversity. Ooh. A shit ton of unity for two of them. The next, uh. 245. 12 traditions is 2344. Two adopted tradition categories. Uh, plus 10%. Cost 2908. Need to build up to 2908. I have 1,069. Yeah, we're not going to spend them yet. Keep going. Keep going. 
I'll first put your, your, your upgraded, right? So yes, we can move you back to here. And then these guys can merge. Thank you. Oh god, my consumer goods are going down. Alright, let's do this. Anyway, decisions. I can... I want... Special project complete. Interesting. Team under science officer. I'll just add research there. We gain valuable engineering if we analyze the way they were designed. We should consider construction of a permanent science outpost in orbit. Well, sure. So send you, because you're the closest one. To there. Oh, actually, you're closer. Build that research station. I'm gonna have to start going through here in a, in a bit. I have enough. Anyways, industrial, yeah, industrial. Do that. We need more fucking consumer goods. Yeah, you. Oh, you're you're just sitting there. Well, use research. You also just kind of sitting there. Okay, governing ethics. Following a long period of growing support for the patriotic vanguard, the Hadadashi dynamics has finally embraced the faction, adopting their core values and policies. As a result of bringing the, they've become more outwardly militaristic. Interesting. You go, go research this shit. And then go research this shit. We need... Allow us to terraform planets. Doom world habitability. Ooh, 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 because then I'll be able to terraform. And the planets that I have. Hmm. Okay, pause, pause, pause for a second. There's a size 22 arid world here. Look at this. Look at this. I can generate all of the fucking money in the world. In order to do that, do I need to... terrestrial sculpting to terraform planets? And, well... Terrestrial sculpting. Yes. Turn that into a fucking continental world. It's size 22, it's fucking huge. And it's, I can just produce all of the money I need. That may be, that may be worth it. Fleet command unit. Oh, fleet supremacy. Our navy is our uh, ship's starting experience. Ship build speed. Not weight from fleet power. Ship upkeep. Uh, ship upkeep. I haven't discovered any tomb worlds yet, have I? Can't remember. Let's do this. Expansion planner.
What does the fuming bug do? Max gas extraction wells. Oh. Hmm. We voting on? Not even sure what we're voting on. Oh boy, the ready shield. Running against it, my fleet power is sixty-one. In ship upkeep is plus five percent. I don't like that. I am up late, Wilhelm, because I'm trying to take over the galaxy. Right now, I'm dealing with politics. <laughs> the Commonwealth of Man is is called a galactic community, you know, quorum to try to get the ready shield. Uh, what's it called? Resolution enacted. Diplomatic weight from fleet power goes up plus 20%. Um, and naval capacity goes up plus 10, but your ship upkeep also rises. And, I mean, I have them. You know what? Fuck it. I'm not going to oppose it. I like to grow my power. What are you doing tonight there, uh, Wilhelm? I feel like... Allows us to terraform. Yeah, we're going to terraform because we have a bunch of planets within our that we cannot inhabit. But I would like to. Ooh, a nutritional plentitude. Pretty good on food right now. And we're about to get some... We're about to get more fleet power from that resolution. Because that resolution will increase the size of our galactic fleet. Uh, oh boy. Motherfucker. Uh, oh, only 250 energy to get rid of you? Just lurking tonight. Hey, no problem. I had a good stream tonight. I got a couple followers. Um, got a, a subscription. See, RTS is that's where it's at. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a. Uh... Today was a good night. I think I'm actually going to be calling it quits though. It's 1230. I'm just going to pay these guys off. Uh, so that they don't bother me. You know, thermal. Ooh. Ooh. Mints and ancient geothermal extractors. Nice. All right, so there's a bunch of shit that needs to be built. Technology secured. You're you're moving up that way to build that. You can 
build that research station. And you're no order. I thought I told you to do this. And go this way. Sure. <laughs> um, ooh, good. Interesting. Situation log updated. I'll research that project first. Uh, and then you'll be able to go there. Engineering research. Fleet command limit plus 10. Ooh, destroyer. Yes. About fucking time. About fucking time. I add one or two of those to my fleet. You're going to build there. You're on your way to build up there. You're researching that shit. What are you doing? Are you moving on to research here? And then research there. Going that way. You're currently researching that. So then you do that. And then go and go. And go and go. Gotta research these things. Okay, so now you're good? a truce. I don't remember being at war with you. Can I just offer you things, please? Can I maybe give you this? And this? And maybe that will... Oh boy, I don't want that. do that maybe I will just help in increase because you guys are huge offer trade deal good Special project complete. Hmm. Nice. Alright, now where's this? Uh, where's the big thing? The sovereign Ishni commonalities. Here they are. These guys, they're very cordial with me. They're very powerful. Can we do a research? Why can't we do a research? Please. Oh, cancel. What about a... Why can't they? They don't like me. They don't like. Well, they're cordial with me. Why don't they? Uh... Oh, because they're militarists. They're militarists. Oh, and they have the federation. Maybe they just don't like me. Hmm. Interesting. All right. Well, can I? Is also have a superior thing. I have a non-aggression pact and a research agreement. I would, would love a research agreement with you guys. We're moving up. We're increasing. Sorry, I 
this, but hey. It works. Because it's it's the music. I have one of those kind of like low voices. For people who just kind of want to listen to uh, streams while they go to sleep, uh, you could do a hell of a lot worse than my stream. Construction complete. Nice. Send you back. Technology secured. Ooh. Nice. Got FTL inhibitors now. Moat harvesting traps. These uh, intricate visit trap volatile most what's in the energy fields, funneling them into special containment zones below drown. Or fields. Represent the next generation of energy screens replacing the older deflect. Ooh, okay. Yes, yes, yes. Shields, please. I need to upgrade my fleets. So what do they need to upgrade? Oh, they need to upgrade their lasers. Vessels upgraded. Ooh. Yeah, with the purple lasers. But they got hangers, too. These bad boys... Nobody needed anybody coming to mess with this. They got like 4,000 fleet power just hanging out in this star system. And FDL inhibitor. Like this is this is a fleet you don't want to mess with right now. My Mangino line. Oh you since you're done you didn't yeah, build that mining station as well. Uh, you're build. Uh, you're already building a research station. Ooh, what is this? From Kunbar, show the star pulsating regularly. Where is that here? Oh, right here. Okay. <laughs> Uh, but when the crew on Yunus Copernicus arrived on site, there was no evidence to support this data. While most of the crew are in agreement that the anomaly was caused by a sensory malfunction, science officer Amar Alawi discards this theory. Amar Alawi claims to have discovered similar pulsating energy emission patterns elsewhere and now fears that something strange is happening to the galaxy's star. They have charted the course to the nearest affected star. We must get to the bottom of this. Situation log updated. Uh, okay, I'm not involved in that. Good. Good. You have to go... Uh, who are you? Amor Alawi. Since you have decided that that is a thing... Go to. Uh, Amor Alawi, where is she? Well... It's on Thrish. Okay. The closest. Nice ship. You're investigating that. You're investigating that. You're done there, right? Yeah, moving to the Yolta system. Okay, yes. Now, first you're going to here. Construction complete. Peace. Oh no! Envoy Edmund Marsh has died. Well, now here's a question. What do I do with uh, my...
Oh, he was just immediately replaced. Okay. And how's this? Okay, so you've gathered information, I assume. Intel, 41 of 27. Intel is changing at a rate of... Government medium diplomacy low. Low technology, low military. Your intel will tend towards the highest of base intel or from infiltration. Yep. I can't get much more on these guys. Hmm. I can go attack them. Our fleet power is inferior to ours. Which is great. Because these guys are rivaled. Right, yeah. I'm gonna close borders here. They're suspicious. Yeah, they're these guys are terrible. They're a devouring swarm. Hungers and consumes. Good. Yeah. Uh, and I guess we're going to declare a rivalry, right? Because... I mean, I don't think I've... I'm not gonna do that. Just containment, that's it. We just need to try to contain them. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna take these guys and we're gonna start building out and we're gonna block up here. Yeah. That's also a continental world that we should try to inhabit at some point. Try to get closer to them. <laughs> hmm. Don't really care who wins. It's not going to affect me in the long run. Special project complete. Hmm. When the crews arrived to the tourists, they were able to confirm that the sensors were indeed malfunctioning. The good news is that not only were their initial estimates for the star's energy, but grossly understated. Maria Batista seems to have learned from past mistakes. Ooh, meticulous trait. Plus three, remove, plus three from Thrish, add plus eight. Ooh, money to Thrish. That's great. Limbo. Signal originates from the... Remains of an antenna like structure. Uh, exploratory probes were dispatched from Neonis Copernicus to the surface to investigate. Uh, the Maddock more closely with science officer Alawi was found a cavernous vault that, while easily pried open, was evidently the last safe house and refuge of some long dead race of aliens. While reasonably technologically advanced, it seemed they never reached for the stars and perished in some planet wide natural disaster. The vault is immense, losing thousands upon thousands of black boxes that the UNS Copernicus has determined to be data storage devices. Situation log updated. <laughs> Research that shit. Discover the secrets for me. Private collector on Hyrule has somehow come into ownership of an ancient precursor artifact believed to be Voltaeum in origin. Despite government pressure, the collector has so far been reluctant to part with it. Logs at a museum. <laughs> All right, Indy. 
Um, no. Everyone has their price. Pay it. Pay the man. How close are we? Ooh, I think one more. That should be this one that we're working on. Mm, oh well. We have a new chancellor. Oh no, no, Dolores Mwanga. What is her mandate? Build energy infrastructure. Energy districts. All right. Oh. Well. Construction complete. Special project complete. Hmm. There's a tomb for hopeful immortals. Science officer Lowy asserts that the huge blocks of ternary code found in the databanks are neural images, digitized brain scans. Doubtless, the aliens of Kunbov 4 considered his this their only shot at any kind of survival, following whatever calamity befell their planet. They did not have the means to resurrect themselves, but banked on the impossibly small hope that eventually someone else would have those means. Hmm. Well, we do not download the neural patterns for safekeeping. Uh, you gain less, but you just kind of leave them there. Definitely tried to leave up. Following whatever claim we have, they did not have the means to resurrect themselves. Banked on the moon. Eventually, someone else would have those means. Get no dinner or bed base for safekeeping. Oh, and another person died. Gener two generator districts. Good. Uh, UZ died at the age of 91. Wow, jeez, okay. And then Federation Association offer Cosmic Pact. I would like to, to I would like to receive an uh, uh, so, uh, Federation offer. That would be awesome. Everybody's in a federation but me. I ain't in no federation. I guess she wouldn't want to be in a federation. There's no defenses. Does have a, a shipyard though, which is good. I haven't built defenses there yet. You know what we need? This is what we're gonna do, and then we're gonna we're gonna call it a night. Uh, we are one artifact away. So what we can do is just find one. We need to spend twenty-five of them. Fuck. Never mind. Here's your artifacts. Already gone there. Gotta be another one nearby. 
probably one of these two, right? The only two things that I haven't, like, discovered around. Or somewhere up here or something like that. I don't know. Anomalies, right? Signs are, oh, no, it's that's the one. It's being researched now. So that's the one in... Where is it? Rambo. Oh, it's the hard one. Okay. Yeah. I wonder, can I send multiples? Can you also research the anomalies in the system, or no? Okay. I want to do that. Yeah, you're close. You do this one. I'm just supposed to buy the Cosmic Pact. Can't I? A negative 18. I guess we're, we're improving relations, though, so... Can I maybe make a gift? And then their opinion of us. Trust. Same authority. Improve relations. Plus 41.7 per month. Maybe. What if I do this? What if I give them a favor? Hmm. in return for an active sensor link. There we go. Yes. Where have we discovered these sites? Oh, we did it over there. Because now we we know how big their place is. Yes. We have an active sensor like look at there, Jesus. Holy shit. Holy shit. You never want to go. How how can you say that the, our our fleet size is is fucking? Oh, it's those guys. Okay. Yeah, no, I don't want to ever fight those guys. How about? Oh, they're, they're assault fleets, aren't they? Yeah, they're not, they're, their fleets aren't really all that strong. I have, like, this kind of, like, murder fleet right here. 2,000 power. I can kind of, like, wipe the floor with these guys. Nice. Nice. Oh, ooh, steel technology will automatically fail when used against us, and debris from our destroyed ships cannot be studied by other empires. That's great. Technology is simply not a way to solve a problem, but it is a language by which we ascend beyond the mundane. Grasp the void, the past, one vision, monthly unity, pop amenities usage, and governing ethics attraction. Hmm. History of nature. Continues to grow. So it's beating heart, executive figure. Edict by now. Yeah. Ooh. As we reach for ever greater heights, we must not leave behind those who have loyally served us. 
glorious future of our empire was always meant to be a shared destiny. Or do we do enigmatic engineering? Encryption is plus two, which is good. Hmm. Requires almost be paused. Oh, I'm a xenophile. Nihilistic acquisition. Colossus. What? The colossus is where fever dreams of terror as titans requires three of it to be selected person. Okay, well, that's fine. Maybe I'll get rid of the xenophile ethic. I want this. Has Titans, which I haven't researched yet. Requires three other essential perks. Alright, we'll get there. We'll get there. Nihilistic Acquisition elects the Raiding Bombardment Stance, which in turn allows us to... No. Ooh, evolutionary Mastery. Synthetic Evolution. No. A Colossus. That's what we're working towards. All great works require sacrifice. The rest of the galaxy may not understand, but they will comply. Uh, we're going to just work towards Colossus. Three other Ascension perks. And so, right now, I think, Subject Integration Influence Cost... Subject trust cap. Um, no, I think enigmatic engineering, encryption plus two. Nobody can steal our technology, though our technology isn't exactly the best right now. So we're gonna go towards, yeah. And I think this is the next one we're gonna go towards. Research alternatives increased by one, and science test level cap increased by two. Leader experience gained. Because then what's this? Uh, research speed is plus 10% if you unlock this whole thing. Empire Sprawl. Where do I go Diplomacy? Maybe that's what I want. Trust gap by plus 15 or trust growth. Yeah, we want diplomacy next. Especially if we want to become a new one. Made from economy. Because my economy isn't the best. It's like. Honestly, I oppose them. Just I, the, you know, don't like the victims of the solar panel, black bulbs, everything. Listening post starbase modules and buildings. Page your output. Ooh, I like that. All right, one o'clock leave been playing for three and a half hours <laughs> i'm gonna have to edit this video down a little bit um i that's gonna be it for now uh we've gone we've done a lot these are long plays i hope you enjoy them um but uh, yeah next time 
we will continue our conquering of the galaxy. I don't know if it's conquering. Right now it's kind of just fumbling through. Uh, but basing our, our on, on, on Sheev's, Sheev's wishes, um, we're going to have to attack these guys and start discovering some shit down here. Uh, we're going to have to go through them. We're, we're trying to contain them, but maybe we can annihilate them. Who knows? Uh, we'll just have to see if we can get some of these guys in on the war. Anywho, that will be next time that we play this game, that we uh, try to conquer the galaxy and become the Senate. All right. Thank you for joining me, everyone. And uh, stay safe out there.